I'm Franco Mahi. I'm the program chair for ISSCC 2024. First, I'd like to welcome you to ISSCC. Whether you're attending in person in San Francisco or on demand, we have some fantastic offerings this year, ranging from plenary talks uh, to technical papers, forums, tutorials, short course, a new exhibition, and evening events. Uh, I think this year's conference is really going to be fantastic. Uh, the purpose of this video is to give you an introduction to the Mira Smart platform and kind of walk you through how to navigate that during the conference. And again, this applies whether you're an in-person or on-demand attendee for ISSCC. So let me start by sharing my desktop and I'll walk you through the website. Okay, so this is the landing page, uh, which you'll get to when you uh, log in to Mira Smart using your registration credentials. Uh, there are a couple of things I wanna uh, draw your attention to here, that some useful links. Uh, the first one is a link for the advanced program. So the advanced program can be reached by going to this important information and links uh, link here, and then just going down to advanced program. So that will give you uh, the view of the entire conference uh, schedule. The other, uh, another useful link here is the digest. You can click here in order to download the digest. And then uh, anywhere from this web page, if you want to get back to this, this home page right here, you just click view program. Okay, so going down this page, uh, this basically is just a sequential list of the different events at ISSTC. You can see here on Sunday, starting with the forums and tutorials uh, events here, um, and each of these is a is a, a clickable session. So you can go in and you can get some of the content from that session uh, downloaded or streaming uh, by navigating through this website. So I'll show an example of that. I'll click here on uh, session two. So this is Monday at 1.30, uh, session two. We'll click into that. And inside of session two, you can see these are the, the uh, there's a, a link in here for each of the uh, technical papers in session two. And uh, right here, you can download a PDF just for the, uh, just for session two's uh, papers. Uh, if I click in here to this uh, paper 2.1, in paper 2.1, there are a couple things here to, to go through. So first of all, uh, you'll see here, this is where you can get uh, this is where you'll be able to download information. So right now, the link that's live here is, is this one here, View Paper. So this is if you want to view the, the PDF of the, the manuscript. Uh, during the conference, once the conference starts, uh, there'll be another link here, which will be the slides. You'll be able to click on and download. And then a few days after the live presentation, which will be live recorded, you'll also be able to stream that presentation by returning here uh, and clicking on that link. So basically, this is where you go to get all the the information about the about the the papers or the tutorials, forums, etc. Uh, that you may have registered for. The next thing on this page is uh, voting. So this is your opportunity to vote for uh, your favorite uh, papers or forums or tutorials uh, at ISSCC. Um, I really encourage you to use this system to vote. Uh, it helps us to maintain a high quality uh, here at ISSCC. It's great feedback for the authors about how they did. Um, and it's also what we use in order to give out the awards or uh, uh, for ISSCC uh, 2024. So we'll use your votes to to determine those uh, those awards. The last feature on this page is this questions for authors. So at ISSCC, there's three ways that you have the option to ask the authors questions. The first one is at the end of the uh, during the session at the end of the presentation. There's a short Q and A for the authors in the room. Uh, then uh, at the end of each day, there's an author interview where you can go and talk with the authors uh, and ask questions there. And then the third way to do it is to submit questions uh, using the Mira site here. So you can type the question in here. The authors will be monitoring this and they'll reply to your question, usually not before the live presentation. So you can look for an answer after the live presentation. Um, please be patient with them because sometimes they do get uh, quite a few questions, uh, but uh, they will get to your question uh, and answer it. So going back up then to the uh, home site for session two, the last thing I wanted to show you is uh, about your itinerary. Uh, so if you want to go through and make a schedule for yourself, you can uh, use these uh, these add to my itinerary buttons here. So for example, you can add either the entire session to your itinerary, 
or you can add just individual papers to your itinerary. So you can see here, if I go and click this, now session two is added to my itinerary. And then if I click up here on my itinerary, you can see here now that session two uh, is added to my itinerary. So just a nice way for you to keep track of which papers you were, you were interested in attending during the conference. And then I'll go back up to view program. The last feature of this I wanted to show you is just a way to do some filtering. Uh, so for example, if you want to look at just at regular session papers uh, from technology directions, you would just click these two. And now the sessions, only the sessions that relate to technology directions uh, are going to show up here. So just a way to let you filter through to find things that you might want to see. And if you want to go back to the full view again, just click all subcommittees and all session types. OK, uh, well, that concludes the uh, the tour of the Mira Smart platform. Uh, I want to I hope that you have a, a fantastic time at ISSCC, no matter how you're attending ISSCC. The material that's on this website will be here and available to you through the end of March. Uh, and with that, I just want to thank you for attending ISSCC and hope you have a great conference.